Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. For today's video is how to use ChatGPT for voice assistant. To use ChatGPT for voice assistant, you'll need to integrate the model with a speech recognition system and a text-to-speech system. Here's a high-level overview of the process. First is speech recognition. Set up a speech recognition system that converts Spoken language into text. Popular options include Google Cloud Speech to Text, Mozilla Deep Speech, or the Speech Recognition Library in Python. Configure the speech recognition system to receive audio input from a microphone or an audio file. Pass the audio input to the speech recognition system and obtain the corresponding text strip. Second is ChatGPT. Use an API or framework to integrate ChatGPT into your voice assistant system. E OpenAI offers the ChatGPT API, which allows you to send text queries and receive text responses from the model. Pass the text transcript from the speed recognition system to the ChatGPT API as the user's query. Retrieve the response from the ChatGPT API, which will be the model's generated text. Next is text-to-speech. Set up a text-to-speech system that converts the generated text response from ChatGPT into spoken language. Popular text-to-speech options include Google Text-to-Speech, Amazon Polly, or the PTTS x3 library in Python. Configure the text-to-speech system, receive the generated text response, and produce the corresponding audio output. Fourth is audio output. Play the audio output generated by the text-to-speech system through a speaker or headphones, making it audible to the user. Last is dialogue flow and user interaction. Design the dialogue flow of your voice assistant, including how the user's spoken input and the assistant-generated responses are managed. Implement mechanism for user interactions such as handling follow-up questions, managing context, and handling multi-turn conversation. It's worth noting that Integrating ChatGPT with a voice assistant involves a combination of technologies and may require additional engineering work to ensure smooth user experience. Privacy and security consideration should also be taken into account when working with voice data. Additionally, there may be specific API frameworks or libraries available to your chosen programming language or platform that can be simplified the integration process. It's recommended to consult their respective documentation for detailed instruction and best practices. So that's it. I hope that you learned something and this video helps. And if you have any questions or comments, can you put it in the comment section below and make sure to subscribe and like to our channel. Thanks!